he didn't care what people thought about who he hired. Right. Like you see, how often do you see that people just hire this guy so they can win the press conference? Right. Or somebody write a nice article about him saying, oh, well, you hired this guy and he's got all this experience or he's got this big name. And all of a sudden that's going to translate to success on the field. He just hired simply the guys that he thought were best for the job. And a lot of those guys you mentioned there, you know, really weren't big names. They weren't kind of major players in this business, but he knew that they were going to come in and make a difference at Texas Tech at the time. And then I think the other thing was he he let other people work. Like he he gave you a job. He expected you to do it. He gave you kind of the the rope to go out there and work and to get and get the job done. Whereas a lot of guys sit there micromanage and don't really let coaches grow. 